for me, it's a familial kind of thing. My mother actually set up the charity all of those years ago, so I kind of grew up with that in the background. Back in COVID times, I had I was on maternity leave from my other position, and my mother had spoken and she'd had funding secured for a development officer, which is where I came in then. It's something that, you know, it's kind of led my whole my whole life I suppose with you know my my father did work in and out of prisons he he, had to, he was a prison chaplain and that was where the idea for the charity came out that they had done in reach working with people and they wanted to actually look at how they give back long story short that didn't come about and that was where then my mother was looking at setting up the charity it was a conversation with the chief probation officer at the time in Bridgend who then had said have you thought about working with young people and trying to intervene in those lives and so giving back and kind of looking at how you kind of get people you empower people essentially to make those changes and things and I think that's something that is at the heart of what we do so our mission statement is to build bridges 